Fort Kent is one of the jewels that sits on the crown of Maine. It's a beautiful town where recreation, farming, forestry, manufacturing, and education all combine into an adorable, friendly community. Fort Kent rests handsomely across the St. John River from Clare, New Brunswick, Canada. Yet, it is only 187 miles north of Bangor, which translates to about three and one quarter hours of gorgeous Maine scenery. Fort Kent is an accomplished community with a handy hospital, plenty of restaurants, a healthy fire department, and a competent police force. This recreational town is a source of great hunting and fishing. If you are into canoeing, my goodness, there's the Fish River that runs right through town, and adventure trips start up in the Allagash. How about snowmobiling? Fort Kent is connected to over 10,000 miles of snowmobile trails in the state of Maine and an endless supply across the border in Canada. Perhaps riding an ATV is your pleasure derivation. Mister, there are well-maintained ATV trails, but keep an eye out if you're coming into town because you'll see four-wheelers tooling here and tooling there. If you like hiking, why, there's trails all over town, and then there's Lonesome Pines Trails, the local ski mountain. I will have a link in the description below of their website for more information. Fort Kent is also the destination for great family events, such as the Tour de la Vallée, which is a bike race of four divisions ranging from 25 to 100 miles that travels along the scenic St. John. On River Valley. Then there's the Ploy Festival. If you've never had buckwheat pancakes or ploys, your life is incomplete and you need to come to the Ploy Festival and come hungry. Then there's the Fort Kent International Musky Fishing Derby. You know, the St. John River Valley has at least 225 miles of great fishing habitat for musky fishing. Fort Kent has numerous industries providing jobs in a stable economy, from logging, agriculture of various kinds, construction, transportation, paving, machinery, welding, health care, social assistance, and hospitality, to name a few. Fort Kent, as the name implies, was the site of a historic fort set up during the Bloodless Aroostook War, the same war that established the town of Masadis. You can come visit the site located alongside the river. Now, alongside the Fish River sits the University of Maine, Fort Kent, Maine's most northern university campus. You can see the well-organized campus just there. What town would be complete without a list of eating establishments? Here's a quick list. Rock's Diner, China Garden, Al's Dairy Freeze, Doris's Cafe, Two Rivers Lunch, Swamp Butt Restaurant, Moose Shack, Two Walker's Pub, and for fast food, there's always Subway, McDonald's, and for taverns, there's The Crossings, which has live entertainment pool tables and pizza. Look for them directly across from the start of U.S. Route 1. Did you know that this YouTube channel has an expanding list of town reviews like this and so many more videos to come? Hit the subscribe button to see more videos when they come out normally weekly. Thanks for watching.